Why are there rich countries and why are there poor countries? We like to think that rich countries are developed and poor countries are underdeveloped and they just need more time to catch up. A lot of this has to do with how everything started. Colonialism and imperialism gave Western countries the startup capital to be where they are at today. And they got this startup capital from robbing resources from the poor countries and stealing all of their human resource in the form of slave labor. But let's put all that aside for a moment. What are the forces right now that are perpetuating this cycle of impoverished countries? A huge factor in this is the World Bank and the International Monetary Fund, the IMF. These are basically the banks of the world. Their goal is to abolish poverty. So they offer loans to poor countries to help lift them out of poverty. But these loans have some pretty big stipulations. The World Bank and the IMF prohibit poor countries from nationalizing their resources. Why would they want to do this? They don't want these poor governments to have control over the resources. They want to keep it in the hands of foreign investors and corporations that are mostly owned by the United States and Western countries. These loans ensure that those resources will not go to benefit the public of those poor countries. Also, these loans prohibit these countries from subsidizing their own resources because they say it'll be unfair in the global market. The loans are subprime, meaning they have very high interest rates, and they may never ever be paid off. So these governments spend a huge part of their national revenue paying off loans. Guess where the World Bank and the IMF are headquartered? They're in Washington, DC. Guess who has most of the control over these banks? The United States. Guess what country decided that it's okay for them to subsidize their exports to have an unfair advantage in the global market? The United States. Poor countries are kept back by the chains of debt. And it's actually poor countries that develop rich countries, not the other way around. Poverty is not foreordained. It is deliberate, it is by design, and it is manufactured. 